the uh, T62A, the predecessor of the uh, T62, T62, a stretch T55 chassis with a larger gun, uh, gun, tar uh, sorry, larger turret ring. Still 100, a hundred millimeter gun, which has been asked about that earlier. Yep. So yeah, there were early run uh, T62s that only had a hundred millimeter rifle gun, mm. but um, yeah. Only five inch service. All right, mm. the original T62 equipped with the 115 millimeter gun, mm -hmm. uh, K version with a command version with uh, better radios and less ammo, and smaller auxiliary, and a small auxiliary generator to run the radio. So yep. uh, without the engine, which going. is weird that they thought this was something worth doing then and then didn't put an auxiliary power unit in the T80. But there you go. Uh, <laughs> I, I bet the command version of the T87. Maybe. No. Anyway, all right. Yep. All right. Uh, object 167. Uh, they had a better uh, 700 horsepower engine and 83 Saga AT ATGM launches uh, produced. Oh, uh, worth uh, noting that all of the T62s could fire a barrel launched. Um, only missile, later. That, that came later. It, it did, but um, the barrel launch. Right, right, the Soviets never built enough of the missiles for them to actually be that. No, but yeah. the, it, it, the T62 wasn't built with that ability in mind. Yeah. It just, they, they realized that when they were doing the. Um, uh, T64 that they could do it. Once you've got a smooth, smooth yeah. ball, you can put anything yeah. down that T62. 